Hi, my name is Nicholas Dwork, and today we're going to be talking about implementing something like MATLAB's PAR4 in Python. MATLAB's PAR4 is part of its parallel processing toolbox. We start by creating a number of workers. Here we've done it using the parpool command, and we've created five different workers. In our example, we're going to determine the number of primes between 2 and 100,000. Here I've created an array of Boolean flags to tell me whether or not the corresponding integer is prime. And now we're going to loop. We're going to loop over the range 2 to m, and in each iteration of the loop, we're going to call the function that I've defined is prime to determine if the corresponding integer is prime. If so, we set the flag. That ends the loop. Because we've used the par4 command here, if we have more than one core, our code will take advantage of that and run iterations of this loop simultaneously. And in this way, the code gets faster. We can determine the total number of primes in our range by summing the prime flags array and display a corresponding output. So how can we get a speed up like this in Python? The answer is by using Python's multiprocessing package, which I've imported here. We call the multiprocessing package's pool function and here I've done so to create five processing threads. We can then call the pool's map function. Map accepts two arguments. And to explain these arguments, I'm going to use the analogy of a loop. The first argument is the name of the function that would be called inside each iteration of the loop. And the second argument is a list of inputs that, we'd, that would be supplied to that function. So here I'm calling is prime on the list between 2 and m. What math does is it breaks up the list argument into several different chunks, in this case five different chunks, and it processes each of those chunks in a separate processing thread. We can determine the total number of primes by summing the is primes boolean array close and join the parallel processing pool and display a corresponding output. And just like MATLAB's PAR4, we would get a speed up if we had multiple cores in our machine. Thank you for your attention.